Anything lootable around? I guess I could try a loot magnet. Uh, I don't remember where it is, though. There it is. Oh, wow. Ended up with a bunch of uh, bows I don't need, and swords, and axes. <laughs> okay, I can see why this isn't the best choice. I'm sure they gave me some other stuff I don't want. Iron shields. All heavy crap. Increases your health, magic, and stamina by 30 points. Sure, I'll put it on. Oh, look. Where'd that come from? Sell that to somebody. You know what would be good? Would be like, in your inventory, a junk category. So that whenever you came across something you knew you just wanted to sell next chance you got, you could just put it into junk. And then you didn't have to find it again later. I bet that already exists in a mod somewhere. Might even exist in this mod somehow. I don't need this stuff. Did I get these guys too? Yeah. All right. Well, that's that. Uh, I assume there's a better way out of here. Somewhere. Somehow. Be, right? Because there was that door in the rock wall. Oh, this is terrible. This whole place is made of skeletons. where we came in, isn't it? Ugh. Oh, it doesn't take all the loot that's on the ground. Only what's on Taken the ground. Taken alone, the Draugr aren't so fearsome. Yeah. They're far more deadly in greater numbers. As we have just discovered, to be another way out. Pardon me. <clears throat> oh, why not a big old roast with some baked potatoes and grilled leeks and... Great big after victory dinner. It's weird. It seems like there has to be another way out. Wait. Oh. 
That that is the door that was that just magically opened itself. Okay. My mistake. just change color off into the distance. Must just be the daylight. Okay. Well, good. Been working on that one for a while. So now we can continue on our way to Go try to learn some more about the Dwemer. Yeah, I finally just slowed down after my meal. It, it takes a little while for that to take effect. Oh, by the way, when you weren't paying attention, I switched from soda to a beer. This is a Weierbacher Werbotten, but... Jesus, wait. I think I've actually had this one uh, previously in this Let's Play, so... I apologize for the repetition, but it's delicious. Also, I hear a bear. Might be that bear that was stuck in the water earlier. I wonder if he found his way out. Two kinds of light. Try to get down here. This way to marker. Are we far from markers? Oh, no, not really. Right down the road. All right, there's Denmark. She's walking real slow. Oh, that's weird. I don't have anything actually affecting my speed. But it sure does seem like she's moving slower than usual. Oh wow, that other light really did make a difference. I was thinking it didn't make a difference, but boy, I sure did notice when it went out. <laughs> Maybe she should have a... Uh... Hello. What do you want, lizard? Nothing, human. Are you one of those freaky guys? Yes. Thought so. Hi. Hmm? Hello. Yes? <sighs> this way to Markar. I thought everybody's just standing out in the road drinking. In the middle of the night. This place is rotten with wolves and bears and saber cats and necromancers and dragons.
rock barbler eggs. These guys might want to consider building their nests a little higher up, or at the very least, dig a hole. One of these days I'm going to be attacked by rock warblers. That's the one! That's the one who steals all our eggs! Hello! As if Skyrim didn't have enough outsiders. Now we've got mercenaries from Hammerfell strutting about. I thought they went home. They were supposed to have gone home. sure why it lit up in that way but it was kind of nice even if it was a little theatrical I hope I don't get in trouble for this There's probably really pissed off. What the hell is this light doing up here? Hello. Hello. Traveling in the reach is dangerous. Yeah. You need a city of Markarth, sure is a beauty. Yeah. No doubt about that. It is pretty. What do you know about it? It's an old city. Legends say dwarves built it first. Uh -huh. Then after they vanished, the natives moved in. Finally, the Nords took over around Tiber Septim's time. That bent a few folks' arms the wrong way. How do you mean? That's right. Whole group of the natives called the Poor Swarm rose up against the Norns. Drove them out. Then Ulfric Stormcloak came with his militia. That must have been a sight to see him shouting folks to death. You'd think that'd be the end of it. But those Poor Swarm are still in the hills. And they're as vile as wolves. Mage light looks really pretty in the distance. So who are these Forsworn people anyway? They, um... They tried to beat me up in a redoubt earlier. They just called themselves the people of the Reach. Not a common blood with the Bretons by the looks of them. Used to have their own kingdom to the Nords came. Now they're at the bottom of the hay path. Well, that's not fair. So, um... Is it true that dwarves built the city? That's right. At least according to them scholars. Stonework's clearly not Nord, that much is for sure. Yeah. Old elven fella named Calcimo, up in Understone Keeps, the one you want to talk to for more about that. Okay. Wrote all those books. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I have those books. And you're wearing dwarven armor! Works out really well. Well, come on, Stemmar, let's get a room at the inn. I hope it isn't like the state bird or something. I just keep stealing eggs.
is Markarth, Traveler. Safest city in the Reach. That'll be a nice change. Hello. Heard about you and your honeyed words. All the way here? You heard about me? <sighs> yeah, you're right. We're tired. We'll explore tomorrow. Get to learn all about the Dwemer. Hopefully, get started on Dwemerverse. I hope. Oh, the market's still going on. Hey! Hey! I die for my. By the divines, the Forsworn are here in the city. Everyone, stay back. The Markarth City Guard have this all under control. There are no Forsworn here. You was happening? Margaret? Why? Margaret. Attacked right on the streets. Yeah. Are you all right? Did you see what happened? Keep the light. Why are you doing that light? Um. Yeah. Uh, some of they were like shouting about the Force Warren being the city or something. The Force Warren. Yeah. Strange. Well, well, I hope the eight give you more peace in the future for what it's worth. Nine. Just nine. Oh, I think you dropped this. Some kind of note. Looks important. Do you know anything about what just happened here? Yeah. Hmm? No. I was just getting some fresh air. I had one too many pints of mead at the Silver Blood Inn. All right. I'd better get going. Need to get going. What is it? Nothing. I just wanted to see your face. Oh, sorry. She, um, she won't be here long. I'm a student at the college, and that's just practice. She's completely bound. She can't do any harm. Just, I'll, I'll just... Uh... Can I... <laughs> do I have any way to just get rid of her? I don't know if that's gonna work. I'll try though. I'm trying. Um, this is very embarrassing. Here, um, this is my doggy, Savalo. He's he's. He's much less threatening. He's just a puppy. He's <laughs> very friendly, actually. <coughs> We're just gonna go. Just be very nice to everybody. first impression. Everyone probably thinks Come I'm a necromancer in. or something. The Silver Blood Inn has plenty of strong drink and clean rooms. Great. I am really tired, to be honest with you. This is the Silver Blood Inn. I'll let you figure out who owns it by yourself. Okay, thanks. If I can't get you something, I'm sure my wife will bellow at me until I can. <laughs> All right, there's, I didn't really need that information. Um, yeah, could you fill my bottles with water? 
Thank you. <coughs> Guess it took him a while. Um, do, is, do you have any trading that we could do? Take a look. Probably don't have much money, but. Oh, boiled eggs. I'll take those. You. I'll take that. I'm running a little low on. Ooh, a meat pie. Nice. Take this out. Milk! I have been told repeatedly that I am a milk drinker, so. Oh, some rabbit stew. I'll take that. Venison stew. One of those. Good, now you have a little bit of money. No, I'm not gonna sell that stuff. Here, why don't you take that? Wait, to, oh, I already had venison stew. Ha! Whoops. Actually, I don't really have much of anything you'll buy. So, um, how about a room? Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Just for the night is really all I need it for. Thank you. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Quest Denbar, we got a room. Maybe there'll even be two beds if we're lucky. I know you get tired of sleeping on the floor. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Thanks. Wow, I'm actually feeling tired now. <laughs> No, just the one bed. Oh, but I'm allowed to have all this stuff. That's nice. Thank you. Wow. Wow. What's with all the soul gems? It's nice that I can just take this stuff. Not much in here, though. Stemper, go get your own room. I'm sure there's another one. Ugh. Okay. Um, crap. I don't have volume one with me. I left it at the house. I was just thinking maybe I should read Dwemer Inquiries before I go talk to Kelsimo. And be like, oh, I read your books. But I don't have volume one with me. 